and welcome to Facebook Live where today I wanted to remind you to update your goals in my fitness pal so just if you don't know what my fitness pal is my fitness pal is a free app on your phone where you can make a food diary so you can track your foods but also it will tell you how many calories that you should eat on your height your weight etc uh, and also you can log your exercise and it basically does all the maths and works out and guarantees that you're going to lose some weight that is the most important thing uh, also in here you can track your weight as well so you can see a nice little graph to keep you motivated and keep you on track so i just want to go through updating the goals the reason being um, i went through mine yesterday um, and we all put in there that we're quite active. Most of us are quite active, especially if you're standing. So as a standard, it will give you a certain amount of calories. So for instance, every day it used to recommend for me to have 1,800 there. Now I've changed my base activity level because as you know, I'm a fitness instructor, I'm, I am active. Um, so it used to give me 1,800 calories a day. So it's really important if you have changed your lifestyle, which all of us, most of us have uh, become inactive now, haven't we? Uh, so we do need to update our goals. So what I'm gonna do is show you how to get there. So this is the home page as soon as you open your app you should get something that looks a little bit like this now on the android if you pull down a little bit you'll see my fitness pal and click on the three little lines so open up the menu basically if you've got an iphone it's located somewhere at the bottom here okay but if you've got a android then click on there so you've got the options and then scroll down to goals so I'm going to go to goals, click on goals, and then this happens, okay? So you can see on there, it says your start weight, your current weight, your goal weight, your weekly goal, and then your activity level. Can you see that? So activity level is the most important one. So I want to click on there, and as I said before, it asks me, am I not very active? lightly active, active or very active. So I've changed mine from lightly active to not very active. Because as I said, my base rate, if I was to just stay in the house all day and not do any exercise, then it will give me the correct calories for that. Obviously, if you do do some exercise, which I'm doing currently, then it will give you the extra calories. So just to um, not overeat if you're not going to be active. This is why I'm telling you to update these just so you don't it's basically a guarantee that you will lose weight and you won't end up by the end of the day with a minus so I've just clicked on that there as well uh, the other two things I wanted to show you in here as well if you've previously weighed more before starting using my fitness pal you can actually backdate your weight so if you have a look on the start weight you can actually put your start weight in there with your highest weight and your date. So you can see I've got mine from 2001 at 31 stones. So that's really nice. And then your graph will actually show you your total weight loss instead of just your weight loss since you've been using MyFitnessPal. So that's the first thing that I like. The other thing under goals as well, and I've done it with quite a lot of you, is your nutritional goals. So if you click on there, um, it will tell you how many calories, which obviously you don't want to change, but it will also say uh, percentage of carbohydrates, protein and fat. So if you're a protein type like me, uh, you want to be having uh, not that. <laughs> <laughs> if you're a carbohydrate type, then this is roughly what you need. 50% carbs, uh, protein 20% and fat 30%. Uh, if you're a protein type like me, we're going to click and change that. So carbs are going to go down to uh, 20%. Protein, I'm going to up to 50%. And fat, I'm going to leave on 30%. So if you're a protein type, that's what it looks like. Um, if you don't know whether you're a protein, a, a carb or a mixed, if you'd like to do some online coaching with me uh, via telephone or online, I can coach you through uh, your metabolic type by doing the metabolic type test with you and also help you with other aspects of your lifestyle. 
uh, and why we're also in the goal section as well um, you can actually put your own fitness goals so I've got my fitness goals in there um, I want to do seven seven days a week so seven workouts a week uh, for a minimum of 20 minutes I'm keeping it nice and easy as I said uh, just in case the restrictions do go any further that's my minimum commitment so that was the goal page on my fitness pal and as I said if you haven't used it before it's really great just to track uh, what you're eating and what activity you're doing to guarantee you're gonna lose weight um, if you want to download it for free just go to your Play Store or the Apple Store on your phone and download my fitness pal uh, for the full video of how to use my fitness pal uh, and set it up and everything it is on my youtube channel which is youtube.com forward slash judy bunting right guys happy friday have a nice weekend i hope you're coming a little bit brown like me this week has been unbelievable i actually feel like i'm on holiday it's great so thank you for joining me guys have a great friday evening and i'll see you again next time bye bye for now Bye. <laughs>